Hey y'all, it's Dominique, and of course I forgot to do my intro. Um, but in my last vlog, I brought you guys along for my last week of medical laboratory school. This vlog will be prepping for graduation. And it's just crazy because I mean, by the end of this week, I will be officially done with medical laboratory school. You know, just for anyone that is in medical laboratory school and you're in the thick of it, or feel like you're just struggling, just know that it will be worth it in the end. Just look forward to the future and where you want to be several months from now, a few months from now, a few weeks from now, a few days from now. Just always remember why you started, but also remember where you are trying to get. What is your end goal? Always keep that in mind because school is only temporary, so it's not gonna last forever. Let's, now, let's get into the video. Look what I picked up today. <laughs> picked up my cap and gown today. They gave me the harness cord. What we're gonna do today is decorate my cap. A hot glue gun and my glue sticks. I went to Hobby Lobby and picked up some stuff. I don't know how this is gonna work. I really hope the flowers don't fall off. I'm gonna be so sad. Hopefully the glue gun is enough to keep them up there, but that is what I'm gonna be doing today. So let me tell y'all the story of my broken camera. It's not even a story. Like I was trying to film me um, decorating for Christmas because I was putting up the Christmas tree and we were putting all the ornaments and all that on it. So I had the camera set up in the middle of the living room on the tripod. And next thing you know, you know, it was just standing in the middle of the living room, unprovoked and everything. And next thing you know, all I hear is and I turn around <laughs> and my camera's on the ground and I pick it up and I'm like oh it'll be okay but then it starts malfunctioning and just spitting errors to me and then I look at the lens and there is a big crack in it I don't know if y'all can see this you see that right here oh there there's a big crack in it that was the demise of my camera lens and if you know, if you know about cameras, you know these things are expensive. So, I'm just thankful I don't have to buy a whole another camera and that the body is okay. But, I would prefer my lens to be okay too. <laughs> so now I'm filming on my phone. I have a Google 4A 5G. I'm filming on that until my new camera lens comes in, which is my early Christmas gift now. <laughs> So I'm back filming on my camera now because my new camera lens came in so I was able to replace this one. I'm getting into the Christmas spirit and I'm about to wrap my gifts for this year. The first one I have is for my dad and it's the Pixel 5a 5G. I don't know if I already said it already but my parents are coming down for graduation. So I'm gonna wrap this one just for giggles. He already knows it's coming. The next one, I 
I'm going to do is for Corey's sister and her fiance. This is just a funny little adult card game that I was like, oh, they might like this. They might play. They might play with it. So that's my gift to them because they're coming down for Christmas this year. That's done. Um, I'm getting my mom some shoes. I'm just waiting on her to let me know which one she wanted. She had been looking for some specific shoes for the last few months, but she didn't tell me like what kind, what kind they were and what kind of colors she wanted and stuff like that on the shoes. So I'm just waiting for her to let me know so I can get her her shoes that she wants. I can't show the rest of the stuff because the person that they're for, they watch my videos sometimes. So just in case, I'm not gonna show it. Unless she really shop at Bath and Body Works, you wouldn't know what's in here, so. This is that. I graduate today y'all and it is gonna be an in-person ceremony um, I'm getting dressed now so let me show you my ooh, let me show you my little outfit let me show you my outfit and my cute little boots I think it's cute it's enough um cuz it's gonna be cold so I think it's cute for the occasion and this is my completed graduation cap I just think it looks so beautiful. I really want to keep this one on the wall. It looks so cute. It came out really, really good, I think. So yeah, that's that. So I probably won't be able to pick up the camera a lot today. Um, I still have to do my makeup, but then I have to be by the school around five for the graduation practice and all. And my parents are coming into town for the ceremony, so I'll get to see them later on today. They're coming from out of town, so they're, like, they're about three and hours away. I'm glad that they were able to come and make it and celebrate with me. Hopefully you can read that, but it says, uh, class of 2021, behind you, all your memories, before you, all your dreams, around you, all who love you, within you, all you need. And I just thought it was the perfect little keychain and gift that culminates the journey that we've shared together. Like school's done, but now we have this big new journey of starting our first job. And a lot of techs in the field have already told me that the first year is the worst year. I don't know how to explain it because I have not gone through it yet. But of course, when I get there, I get there. Um, anyway, it's just, this keychain is just a reminder to keep going, to keep pushing. And as I've been told already, every day gets better as we learn more and practice more. And it's just going to be a big growing experience in general. Anyway, I am getting ready to head to school now. I just have to fix myself up a little more, like put some makeup on or something so I can look less tired <laughs> but I mean I really almost decided against walking in my graduation ceremony mainly because I just wasn't really feeling it but after I thought about it it is an accomplishment and I should be proud to have gotten this far and all that hard work deserves to be celebrated so after tonight I will have officially graduated summa cum laude so really really exciting i'm really really thankful that i was able to make it through this program um especially during covid i really think i'm really really thankful to have had the organization skills to keep up with school clinicals my work my job and youtube as well as whatever life threw my way because it's been a whole lot a whole lot of since my first video that i posted it's just amazing to be able to share with you guys that journey from literally getting my acceptance letter all the way to now graduating the program. You know, I do these videos in hopes that at the very least I can inform somebody what it's like to study medical laboratory science. Hopefully it's kind of inspiring or even motivational to those of you that are students or even people that are looking into this 
career path. My channel going forward will primarily be my journey as a new grad. And that includes <laughs> just everything. I'm getting the job, the job prep process, my first day, you know, all that kind of stuff. So if you're interested, please like, comment, and subscribe to my channel to keep up with my journey in the lab. I'll see you guys next time.